as far as like, when you come out here, what are you trying to get accomplished? Really just dial in on the technique and the assignments and just kind of gelling together as an offense. Seems like you guys are lining up backs, wide, split, in, in the slot, wide, and putting them in motion a lot. How much more complex can that make your offense for defense to deal with? I mean, not really going to speak on that right now, but that's probably a question for Braves. But, you know, it's, we just focus on what we got to do up front, you know. Is it so. fun to add that component to the, to the running game? Yeah, it's always fun, you know, mix things up. Late Andre, if you just got a quick half second there. Just I was going to ask about Peter and, and kind of your thoughts on him and, and how he's been progressing a little bit. Yeah, Pete's been great. First thing I knew, noticed about him is that he's uh, very technically sound. Okay. It's very impressive how smooth he can move his feet and you know keep his, his pad level at a, you know at the same depth. And he's a very smart guy. You know, he's he, he can learn things pretty fast and you know like playing guard. So he's he's a. He's a Good guy to be next to. So I was going to say, I mean, you, you know a thing or two about versatility also. Is it impressive that, that Ricky can kind of come in and try to learn? Yeah, it, it's it's really impressive. Like, learn, when you played one position your whole life and then you got to learn another one immediately, it, it can be pretty daunting. But, you know, he was open to the to the tasks. And, you know, he's, he's doing well so far. From, from what you're seeing on the screen to being out on the field? Uh, pretty well. I would say that, that's one thing that I've really enjoyed is just the learning process in the classroom really does transfer over into the field and, and being able to take coaching points that we hear in there and apply it quicker and, and, and sometimes right away without even having to make any mistakes and just just kind of figure it out um, once we step out on the field because we have a grasp from the classroom. And they're kind of different. So how, how all new is this yeah. uh, I mean, that's <laughs> that's a question I feel like Rave's going to answer. I mean, it's, it's different. There's different words. There's different verbiage. Um, but at the end of the day, it's football. There's a lot of the same plays. There's just different ways to, to dress it up. You like it better? Yeah, I mean, I like it. I love just playing football. I love being here. Um, I love the opportunity that we got. How's it been for Ryan to be here since OTAs and just continuing to build on that, knowing you know he's the guy right now? Yeah, it's been awesome. Uh, been been getting some good reps, get, building some chemistry with guys who, you know, last year weren't able to get that chemistry so much. So. I feel like it's been good um, to kind of build that now and build that foundation. What have you seen from Malik growth-wise? Uh, leading the offense has been great. Um, you know, just really understanding what to do, being able to make the checks, command the offense, the operation. Um, that, that's probably one big area. I and mean, then I feel like that lets him play a little bit more confidently too. Yeah, well, I mean, first of all, Credit to I think the culture of this team, like all, most of the guys are already here, you know. So like it's good to see all the rest of the faces in here. But I mean it's kind of the same schedule we've been doing, so um, not too much has changed. Just got to keep working on ironing out the little details and getting into situational stuff like red zone stuff for the first time. It's um, it's exciting. Have you sensed kind of the competition maybe stepping up a little bit? Uh, yeah, I mean there's competition every day, regardless of what it is. Um, but I mean I think as we get closer and closer to training camp, it definitely does kind of heighten a little bit. We were talking to Brable last week about the idea of it being okay to make new mistakes for you guys, no matter how long you've been here or any of that. How's that been to kind of work through for you? Yeah, it's, it's, it's good to hear that because, I mean, like, you always want to make the right play. You don't want to make the wrong decision and try to force the ball when we don't need to. But, I mean, these are the times to make those mistakes. It's When it's week one, obviously it's not. But, I mean, now it's, it's, now it's the time to experiment. It's time to take some shots and to um, not be um, – you know, reckless, but to, you know, be a little experimental. So, I mean, it's, it's being my first year in the league, like, um, it's, I, I got to do that to get the feel of, you know, uh, the right way to play the position. And how do you feel like picking up this offense? Obviously, guys that have been here, it's a little bit newer for them, and it's new for you coming to the NFL level. What's that level for you right now of taking this offense? It's good. I mean, it's, it's, it has to be uh, very high. And, um, you know, talking to Coach London last week, um, talking about like how I felt like I've been doing it everything like it's a lot on our plate and it would be a disservice for me for it not to be um, if you if you get babied into this stuff like you know you're not going to get ready in, in this as much as a timely fashion so uh, the standard for Ryan's the same standard for me is the same standard for Malik and I think that's the only way you can really treat this process for the development of a young quarterback. Is there a part uh, of Derek will be at the podium in a couple learning of process yeah. that you feel like you've really gravitated towards or have done well in terms of quickly learning a specific area? Uh, well, I mean, I think with like 
we like we make a mic point on every play. That's something that I hadn't really done in college. I, I've handled some protection stuff, but never in the run game. So really understanding like why we're setting up our, our run packages the way we are and, and, and truly forced into understanding why we're doing some things in the run game. Whereas in college, it's like hand it off and what happens, happens, you know. So that's been at least a more fun part for me.